Scandalous Celebs Arrest. Hello and welcome back to Celeb Spotlight. In this video, we're going to talk about some of the wildest celebrity arrests of all time. They have a lot of fame but little or no shame. Celebrities as old as 81 and as young as 27 all made headlines this year for allegedly breaking the law. Their charges range from leading global climate change protests and being within the country illegally to groping women and sexually abusing underage girls. Amanda Bynes The 2010 movie star Amanda Bynes went off the rails in the 2010s after getting pulled over for allegedly taking off the phone while driving and fleeing the scene before getting her ticket in March 2012. Bynes tried to pass a police car in her BMW and sideswiped the car. She got arrested for DUI and spent the night in jail. She was released within the morning and her bail was set for $5,000. Unfortunately, that was only the start of her legal troubles. 50 cents. The famous rapper proved that it's impossible to form it from prison bars to the celebs. One part of 50 Cent's story was told in the semi-autobiographical film Get Rich or Die Trying and it is a well-known fact that he was shot nine times. So it comes as no surprise that he actually served six months in prison for selling cocaine and possessing heroin and a starter gun. Jamie Waylett, the young English actor who gained recognitions for his role of Vincent Crab within the Harry Potter series appeared to have wanted to be the pride of Slytherin House in real life as well. During the London riots in 2012, Jamie Waylett was found in possession of a Molotov cocktail in a pot. He received a 12-month sentence for handling stolen goods and a two-year terms of rampage. Danny Trejo Danny Trejo's rise to fame had quite few twists and turns along the way. But it also explains how he managed to portray bad asses in movies also as he does. During the 1960s, Trejo was imprisoned for 11 years on several charges, including burglary, assault, and drug possessions. He even did one part of his prison time at the infamous San Quentin prison. Kiefer Sutherland Kiefer Sutherland, stars of the hit television series 24 and therefore the sons of Donald Sutherland, is additionally no strangers to correctional facilities. In 2007, Sutherland served 48 days in jail for violating terms of his probations and pleading no contest to DUI charges. Upon his release, he had to undergo an 18-month alcohol education program and attend weekly therapy sessions. Lilo Brancato Lilo Brancato Jr. is the actor many of you remember from The Sopranos and therefore The Bronx too. Those who don't know him for his filmography probably know him for the robbery he was a neighborhood of, which resulted within the murder of an NYPD policeman. Since it wasn't him but his associate who pulled the trigger, he was released from jail after 8 years and returned to acting. Monthly Crew The founding father of such bands as Monthly Crew and Methods of Mayhem lived up to his bad boy reputations. Tommy Lee had been repeatedly placed on probation for a series of violent crimes since 1983, but he was finally sent to jail for the assault and battering of his wife at the time, Pamela Anderson. He served six months and had to pay $6,200 to a victim restitution program and a violence fund. Ja Rule Ja Rule, an actor known for his role within the cookout, got arrested in 2011 for unauthorized gun possessions. He spent two years in jail for that crime but had his stays extended by a further 28 months to run concurrently for evasions. After the term of the first stint were over, he was moved from state to federal prisons to serve the remainder of his punishment. Michelle Rodriguez Michelle Rodriguez was first sentenced to 60 days in jail for probation violations in 2006 but was released after only 4 hours and 20 minutes thanks to overcrowding. One year later, the actress violated her probations again. She admitted to failing to finish community service and drinking alcohol on a minimum of 3 occasions while wearing a monitoring bracelet around her ankle. After that, she was sentenced to 180 days in prison. Black China in 2016, Black China Rob Kardashian's girlfriend was flying from LA to London, but she never made it to her final destinations since she was arrested for public intoxications and possessions of a drug during a layover of Austin Bergstrom's International Airport. Witnesses report that China appeared heavily intoxicated, which the model verbally abused a bartender for refusing her further service. Inhuman behavior for sure. Oscar Olympics after he became one of the world's most famous athletes when he sprinted within the 2012 Summer Olympics in London as a double amputee, Oscar Pistorius caught our attention once again a year later when he was arrested for shooting and killing his girlfriend, Rifa Steenkamp. He was first sentenced to 5 years but his conviction was overturned and increased to 13 years and 5 months. Stephen Baldwin 
Stephen Baldwin was arrested in 2012 for failing to file tax returns for three years, owing the state of York over $350,000 in back taxes. The actor was facing up to four years in jail but pleaded guilty and paid back $300,000 to avoid serving time behind bars. Baldwin was arrested a minimum of another time in 2012 when he was caught driving with a suspended license. With this, we have come to the end of this video. Are you shook or have you already know about them? Let me know in the comment section down below. I hope you enjoyed watching the video and if you do, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel. See you soon in another fun video. Till then, take care.